So what's in this thing? It's five speed with the. No, this is a four speed car. Four actually, four speed with the. It's a 1.6 liter naturally aspirated Volkswagen diesel. The good stuff. Is what it is. All right, so this is the new chariot for my buddy. He's fallen over a Volkswagen rabbit, so I know somebody that had one, and well, here we are. So let's see if this old pig will roll over and run. But first, let's check and see what we got for fluids and whatnot. Okay. So we got windshield washer fluid. I guess this is our coolant reservoir okay which the coolant already needs to be flushed but oh yeah just drop everything why don't i good news is you can reach your hand down and grab your shit when you lose it because this car is damn short it's on there hey i don't smell diesel do you Mm, mm that's clean. So that's a good start. It means nothing's leaking in the fuel pump or anything like that. Had an apple gold filters put on it. Those are good filters. I think they're made by Wix. Supposedly I drove in here. Well, I wouldn't doubt that. This is where I'm going to get a little fearful because I don't know what's inside that tank. I can't smell anything. So... Let it charge for a couple of minutes. Let's see what we got. Put a little bit of laughing gas down and stir up. We'll see what happens. Ah, oh, that sounds horrible, but it'll go. I try not to use this as much as I can. Sometimes they're stubborn. All right, so looks like likewise. Got all that. Bad news is. Left turn signal, is he working? Yeah, it looks like it anyway. Right one? Uh, I don't know, hang on. I hear the relay clicking fast, so. I got one out up here. I don't know if I got one in the back or not. Uh, left side is on now. That one's on. Okay, right side. Yeah, I got the right one in. So I just need a headlight bulb in the front. Or a turn signal bulb in the front. Does this have a sunroof too? Uh, it's supposed to. They so, have it sealed. Yeah, that's uh. Which is more of a sun vent. Because it literally just. Well, that's a sunroof back then, but yeah. Same concept. <laughs> Give us some fuel. Jesus. I wonder if we got a kink somewhere. Dance between the ports. Yeah. Fire in a hole. Uh-oh. Key, what's your problem? Oh, it's gonna... It's going. Okay, she's out. just doesn't want to stay with the throttle up. Mm -hmm. Come on, suck your fuel. It's got a full tank of fuel. Come on. It is right there. Well, so she's on the trailer. Because it's not happy to try to start. It'll start and run, but it's sipping on fuel, so it won't go past, like, half-assed idle. And here, that's where she originally was. That was a good ways in the ground. Impressive.
glue plugs initiated. 30 seconds later. All right, you ready? Fire. Starts right back up, no problem. It runs really good. Pull that cap off, see what cool money you got. It is freshly started after sitting like 10 years, but set it on there, see if it bounces. A little bit. I don't know, maybe take it out and it'll seat the rings again. <laughs> it already rolls cold. And of course, uh, doors are a little. It's fine now. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Your lights are bright now. Of course, the light switch fell off. Alright, bright and shit. Bring up the brakes because they were a little stuck after 12 years. Get us some water here. And so for the moment, got water in it. We're going to flush it out and put proper stuff in it here before long, but for just for test purposes, it's getting water. That and the crap in there is nasty, so no point in putting fresh coolant in there if all that's just mushy, milky crap in there, so. I got to hold the door shut because, uh, yeah, that's nice. Oh, well, cheap car. Speedometer works. At least it looks like it kind of does. No, it doesn't. It's trying to work.
Good to know that those stayed on. All right, I'm impressed. Not bad, not bad. You can get all the license plate that works. Heck yeah. 